talk about my tuke? Uh, I thought maybe you were uh, a dealing weed again. <laughs> you look like a weed dealer today. Today is my weed dealing day, yes. Like, so this is, this yeah. is my weed dealing well, look. Well, from here down, though, you look like a who from Whoville. <laughs> so up here, up here is weed dealer. Down here is who from Whoville. Now, this place is called Nelson and... Oh. No, just the... Nelson the Seagull. Yeah. And... NTS is what we call it here in Vancouver. I've never heard of this place before. Yeah, we went to NTS today. No, it's just today, but I've never heard of it. I just started today. calling it NTS. No, nobody else does that. We should do it though, you and me guys, okay? You're already aggravating me. I know. When you walked into this place, they're making bread. They make their own bread there. Yeah. They have a little bakery and I got really excited when yeah. I saw it. It reminded me of my Nana making bread. They do their own sourdough and they all, they made it into little loaves and they were just chopping them up and putting them to the side. I wanted to get in there, you know, get my hands in that dope. The thing that I like about Nelson the Seagull is uh, Gastown was pretty desolate for a long time. It was the only neighborhood that I was really interested in living in, in Vancouver. And the thing that I liked about it was it reminded me, it had an authenticity, and it reminded me of, of New York. The cups we didn't even talk about. Yeah, I know. Their I was stamp. waiting for you to go into it. I like the cups. Yeah, well, I just like the plain cup with the stamp. We've seen this before with coffee cups and yeah. their, their product stamp. So, uh, you can see it says Nelson the Seagull. NTS. As Jones is calling it, NTS. What's in the circle there? From the kitchen of Nelson the Seagull. I like it. It sounds like a kid's book. Like, and then Nelson the Seagull went to sleep. Yeah. Boo, 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 boo. Monday to Friday, 8 to 5. Saturday, Sunday, 8 to 5. Why wouldn't they just say Monday to Friday? Yeah. Maybe it's a six? You can't really tell. Anyway, so, uh, so Nelson the Seagull, we went there today. You were impressed with the place, except it smelled like burned bread. Yeah, and they also fine. had salted peanut butter cups. They had really good looking treats there. We oh, didn't have yeah. though, because no, we've we already didn't. eaten terribly today. Um, Alright, so let's do it. We had one donut earlier. I had a donut and a half. I had a donut and a half. I had, I had, half. I, I had two donuts. Mm. 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 That's sort of funny because uh, I feel like there's a, a, a very kind of strange sour aftertaste mm -hmm. that leaves this, that I, I let the whole swallow go down my throat, sounds pervy, uh, but then what's left behind is kind of this ghost mm -hmm. sour, this sour ghost kind of dissipates very quickly. So There is a sour ghost in here. There is, you're right. I'm going to start calling you the sour ghost. <laughs> you are some days. No, but I'm not a ghost. Uh, I'll, I'm all up in your face with my sour. Anyway, um, <laughs> this is not my favorite. No, it's not. And it's so strange because the, the aroma is its intoxicating. Like mm -hmm. if it was, uh, what do you call it, prima nocta? <laughs> Which they I, use the reference in Avengers. In I, would, I would want this to be the way my room was scented on Prima Nocta. It feels like it's strong because the way it, it, it it's sour ghosting the middle of your tongue. <laughs> but, uh, what does it sit in your mouth though? The, the middle of my tongue. Because I feel like it goes in high and then the sour ghost drops right <laughs> into the jaw. <laughs> Why it's are we true. laughing so much? The sour ghost, no, it doesn't drop goes in my in jaw. Goes in high and then drops right in. I'll turn sideways so you can see. <laughs> Hi. And then drops right here. You gotta try the bread. You asked me if I, in, well, on the way back here, you asked me if I ever buy a loaf of bread, and I said, no, I live alone. So, Why would I have a whole loaf of bread? What am I gonna do with it? Um, slice it, make it into a sandwich, toast that shit, put some spread on that, just eat it. I would just eat the loaf. You know what I would do? Because it's crispy on the outside, soft the on the inside. Loaf. I would, I would eat the crust, like I would tear the crust off and then I would go inside and like scoop all the doughy stuff out and just eat that. Just go for it. You're like a velociraptor. <laughs> it's really gross. Sorry the Nelson the Seagull. And it's open every day from 8 to 5 or 6. We can't quite read the sticker. You know what though, the food there did look really good. And the cup I would give a 10, but I'm only going to give the Americano from Nelson the Seagull, which features the Elysium bean, a 6. Out of ten. I think you're being generous because you like the name of it and you like the feel I of it. I really like it. I'm so seduced by this place. Sometimes a place can be like that. It's you know? true, but this coffee is not anything higher than a four. So oh, wow. I'm sorry, Nelson the Seagull. I will go in and try your food though, and Jones will go in and just look around and make himself feel like he's well, in New York. Well, it feels like New York, yeah. 
<sighs> You're Canadian now. Just accept it, okay? I'm Canadian. There we go. Thanks for watching! Bye, everybody. Prima Nocta. <laughs> Prima Nocta. That'd be a great name for a coffee bean. Oh, have you tried Oh, my God. Prima Nocta. Prima Nocta bean.